This local sports report is brought to you by Allstate Insurance, a proud member of the Cambridge community, supporting youth athletics. For a free, no obligation quote for home and auto insurance, contact one of their trusted advisors. Call Allstate at 226-444-4465 to speak with your local Cambridge Allstate representative. We continue our 519 flashbacks reflecting on the Jacob Hespler Hawks first ever Offs of Football title. It really was a remarkable run for the Hawks in 2018, all culminating in the nation's capital. Now, two years previous, the Hawks had played in the Offs of Bowl only to come up short. The first year, it was against A.N. Meyer from Niagara Falls. Trey Ford was the quarterback for the A.N. Meyer Marauders, and he led them to the Offs of Championship. Of course, Ford, now a star player with the Water the Warriors and Chris Bertoia in the OUA. The following year, a tough loss to Lorne Park out of Toronto. They beat the Hawks in Hamilton, but the third time was the charm for this group. They went to Ottawa to face the Gananoque Trojans. Here's a look back on the Jacob Hespler Hawks and Gananoque Trojans, the Hawks' first ever offset title. The Jacob Hespler Hawks arriving in the nation's capital shortly after 3 o'clock on Tuesday afternoon. The players unpacking their bags and heading into the football facility here at the University of Ottawa for one final practice and one final run through before Wednesday's big off the Central Bowl taking place at TD Place Stadium, the home of the Ottawa Red Blacks. Hey everybody, the 519 has arrived in the 613 for the biggest high school football game of the season. Is this the year? Is this the group that can finally get it done? Xavier Pineda, the fifth year running back for the Hawks, said after the Kawasa Championship last week, we want to finish the story. We want to finish the fairy tale. Seriously, like that's the, that's it though, spot on. Like he's like finished the fairy tale. Like we got nothing else to do besides finally go get us the Hawks Championship. Like we've been here over and over and we've been to Kwasa over and over and it's just, this is what we've been all working towards. I'm excited. I mean, it's where we're supposed to be. I mean, we're in the perfect place, perfect conditions, and we're going to have a great practice. I think my message tomorrow is going to be have fun. You know, let's play our brand of football and let's have fun. Let's go 88 Doug, 88 Doug. It's now or never. It's, we win it now, and that's, that's our goal. It's something we've looked forward to for for a long time now that we've been here twice and lost and the energy is going to be high. Xavier Pineda and the Jacob Hespler Hawks trying to finish the fairy tale on Wednesday morning. Let's make this field at home today, all right? Let's make this field at home today. Let's show them what it feels like to play Hespler Hawks, all right? Let's go. Yeah, Let the field like <laughs> all daylight. <laughs> we the Hawks like <laughs> this mob. <laughs> this mob. Mario Pineda, former receiver Seth Robertson, and Mr. 41, Darian Morgan, all in attendance, hoping to see a Hawks victory. And there is the prize they are playing for, the OFSA Central Bowl Trophy. And the Hawks catching a break early in the game. The Trojans fumble the ball on their second play from scrimmage, and the Hawks recover. They have the ball on the 12 yard yard line and Jacob Hespler capitalizes on the turnover. Joel Watson to Xavier Pineda and it's a 12 yard touchdown under a minute into the game. Jacob Hespler taking an early 7-0 lead. Next possession for the Hawks, Watson rolling to his right and he hooks up with Aiden Carter along the sidelines. That's a first down on a nice catch by Carter. A few plays after that, handoff to Pineda and from 10 yards out, he scores. Pineda making it 14-0 with his second touchdown of the game. Still in the first, Jack Bukopt going for a 33-yard field goal and he splits the uprights. Jacob Hespler with a 17-point lead. And the Hawks' defense also solid in the first quarter. Owen McDonald and Kyle Whitelaw combining for the tackle on this play. 17 nothing Hawks 
spots after one. Second quarter now, watch number 98. That's Nathan Steckley with a big tackle in the backfield. The Trojans forced to punt after more great defense by the Hawks. Later, how good is this play by Xavier Pineda? He's already got two touchdowns in the game. How about making it three? Pineda goes 32 yards to the house on a catch and run. The Hawks starting to pull away. They take a 24-0 lead. Then a little later, watch the far side. Quinn Robertson with the catch and a touchdown. 38-yard passing play. That makes it 31-0 Jacob Hespler. Back to the defense, Thomas Bloomfield, a fifth-year defensive tackle with a big hit on Matt Donovan. However, the Trojans would drive down the field. It's third and goal, Gananakwe going for it, hoping to get on the board. Braden Clark under pressure, and he's picked off by Connor Martinez, the Hawks linebacker, coming through with an interception. 31-0 Hawks at the half. Third quarter now, Joel Watson looking for an open receiver. He scrambles around and he connects with Aiden Carter. Watson doing it in the air and with his feet. Same series, Watson takes off and he runs the ball inside the 10-yard line. Jacob Hespler in the red zone and they cap off the drive with this short touchdown run by Alex Harmon. He makes it 38 nothing, and as time expires, head coach Greg White getting the old Gatorade shower from his players and the Hawks storm onto the field to celebrate. Yes, the third time is the charm. Jacob Hespler bringing home that elusive offset title on their third try. The Hawks making history, winning their first ever OFSA football title. Best feeling ever. You know what? We earned it. We've wanted it for three years now. We worked so hard to get here. Everybody was in the gym on the off season. We were working hard over the summer. We battled through setbacks and you know, we took we took two losses and we just came back stronger every single year and to this year we just finished it. We've been thinking of this goal for 5 years now, all of us fifth years. It's just been our dream ever since. And like even in our third year when we lost Ann Meyer, we knew we had a chance. We could come back and win this. Every year we thought we could. We never gave up on our dream. Every day we just worked harder and harder, and it's just unreal that it finally happened for us. Honestly, it's an unreal feeling. Like uh, I only started playing football in grade nine, and as soon as I turned into a senior, this is all I was dreaming about, honestly. And finally got it. That's it, man, we did it. I'm proud of the boys, I mean, it's what we needed, it's what we wanted, and we did everything we could to get it done. Man, it feels great, you know, to play with these guys all my life, and, you know, just just to end in this way in a big 48 nothing win, I mean, uh, it's nothing like it, you know, a lot of emotion right now, so, you know, we're just happy with everything. Oh, it's the best feeling, you know, just because I know this is it's my last game of football, and to finish it on a W, and the first loss of the championship for Jacob Hesper, like, 48 nothing, man, like, it's, it's the best feeling in the world. It's probably the proudest moment of my life. I remember last year, Jackson White, or no, two years ago, Jackson White came out to me, put his head on my shoulder, and he's like, uh, you got to bring this one home for the boys. It's your turn now. And I remember at the time thinking it was a big task, but I mean, now that we bring it home, it's, it's really a proud moment. It's a community win. I, f I feel that uh, our administration and our school was behind us. I feel that the, um, you know, Hespler community was behind us. And then, like you say, former players, I got, you know, I lost track of the number of techs. Good luck today, coach. So, you know, it's a long time in the running, so it's, it's, it feels great. For more highlights, visit our website, 519sportsonline.ca. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter.